Hey there guys, Frank Amatic here, and let's go through this puke green castle and rescue the final princess once and for all, finally, final, final. As you might have guessed, this is... I'm pretty sure this is the final level. As it's full of ghosts and daring do. I don't even know what that means. But it's also full of spiders that shoot fireballs for no obvious reason. And meat! Because every castle made owned by a wizard needs to have tons of meat in it. Because you know how wizards are. They like their meat. Yes, I'm implying something. For those of you that are exceptionally slow. Because I know there are some of you out there. Okay, we need 100 gems and a red key, huh? Well, we've got 34 gems. That should be good enough for you, you red bastard. What are you, some kind of communist spreading the wealth like this? Except you're keeping it all for yourself, just like a real communist? Whoa, look out. Ghosts! Help! Help! Speed potion is going to ruin my day, but I picked it up anyway. I'll get that on the way back. Sixty-one. Oh, there's our key. Now we just need to fight and get more gems. Because there are no chests in this level. And I missed it. So the only way to gather gems is to keep killing things and hope they drop them. Did I miss any back here? I'm pretty sure I didn't. Oh no! Mr. Bill! And yet another continue down the drains. You know, I have no idea how many of these I've used. But back to hunting for gems. And hey, I lost all my score, as is typical of the game where you continue. Eh, let's go back to jumping around stupidly. I seem to be having better luck finding things, then. Okay, we got 67. Ha! Huh. 69. I apologize for the length of time this is undoubtedly going to take me, but gems are a pretty rare drop. At least for the most part where they're dropping double gems. Hey. I was hoping there'd be a gem and not a coin behind that. Ah! Go away. I'm going to die again before I get the gems I need. I can sense it and taste it. That is why I hate this level. The completely needless gem hunt they throw you on. Because they couldn't sprinkle a hundred gems around the level, that would be too easy. And you wouldn't have to run back and forth through the same boring area over and over again trying to find them that way. Invincibility will help a little bit. Can I climb back up here? Maybe I missed something back this way. Oh shit, I got a gem there that I can't get. Okay, I'm going back to the open area, because there I can actually pick up the gems I knock out of things. Actually, you know what? I think right here... I'm going to pause the video, and I will be back once I have 100 gems. So, see you in a few. Okay guys, I'm back. 100 gems, and I died once more, as you can tell. And now, holy shit, we are at the final boss. The evil wizard Malkil. Now, you can chase him around... Ah! 
which is likely to get you killed. Or you can hang out over here, where there's only a few spots you can teleport to. And just hit him when he come when he makes himself visible to you. He's going to kill me and I'm going to have to start over, but... This is the easiest way to kill him. Because he pops up in two very easy to hit spots. And one that you can't really hit him from, but he doesn't pop up over there all that often, usually. I love how the game sounds so happy that I'm going to die. All you gotta do is be quick with your reflexes, and he'll die eventually. And also, right here is actually the easiest spot to defend yourself from his stupid homing spell. Come on, buddy. You only got a couple more hits left in you. Come on. Where are you? It's okay. I'm only going to murder you. Shit. Come on, come back. Come on. Oh, that was close. Anyways, now that he's dead, we got the blue key. We get some awesome music as we finally save the princess we were looking for who has no name. Kuros is the most valiant, valiant hero that has ever existed after he left six or seven girls to their death to find one specific one. His quest is over for now. And before you even ask, I am not playing Iron Sword because I can't even finish a single level of it. So, if someone else wants to do that, go ahead, but it's not going to be me. And I can put my initials in, so what the hell, let's do it. Sir Feg. That is my new name. So, see you guys later.